All right, this is not a sponsorship for Nike. This is just totally me. Nike is not paying me for this video. Just trying to show you the side of me. All right, welcome back to the channel. Today is Friday and we are not in the truck and I have decided to start my own little segment of things I like to do out of the truck. So one of them is buying sneakers. Well, I shouldn't say buying sneakers, but um, I'm gonna call this segment uh, David's Friday Sneaker Review. So if you're not interested in, you know, um, you know, in, in sneakers, then you don't have to watch the video. It's just for my sneaker heads out there. Um, I started buying sneakers like a year ago. So I'm about 20 pairs in and, you know, I always thought I would, you know, start a channel and, and just review all my shoes and stuff. So I'm going to do that on my free time. So if you're not interested in it and you're just interested in the box truck stuff, then that's cool. You could just totally skip it and we'll leave this to my sneakerhead uh, people. So the reason why I started with this one is this is more of an investment and not just a regular sneaker that I'm probably gonna wear from time to time. I might wear it once, but so I probably will not wear this sneaker. It probably just may be maybe one time, but um, the reason why I bought this shoe and the retail price for this shoe is actually $400. And if you're a Nike member, you kind of get discounts from time to time. So that's what happened and I ended up buying them. But um, the reason behind this shoe is it is kind of closer to the Back to the Future video when they put out that Nike sneaker, which actually is going for, I think the cheapest you'll find that sneaker is about $15,000. So, and this sneaker right here is kind of based on that design, but it is more of an Air Max type design. So, that is the only reason why I bought this sneaker and I thought about it twice because I don't really spend that much money buying sneakers, but I just thought of this as a good investment. I think if, if you know, with the Nike vision, if people are actually into this, this sneaker will actually go up in price because I'm pretty sure they're going to make a certain number of them and not just make them. Um, so, yeah. So we are about to open it this is the first time it just got here yesterday and i was waiting oh it actually got here today so this is the first time this is the first time opening it so again i don't do stuff like this from time to time but it just felt right to do it this time and when i get my boxes here they're not as big as this one this is huge so it is a whole design i mean it's just it is huge it's not a regular nike box that you're used to and this is just something totally different i mean you can see it from side to side everything is just different about it and I mean, um, I don't know what I was thinking, but I mean, it just felt right for me to do it at the time. So yeah, and I know for a fact that, man, this is beautiful. It just, I mean, they took time to just make this box and I'm pretty sure some of the money that I paid for was going towards this box because the way it's just packaged is just, it's crazy. Uh, tell me when have you ever bought a shoe that comes with a with a manual like that's just that's just how crazy it is so it is the nike adapt automax so there you have it and man it just it's just something out of this world i wow i thought they were actually gonna be bigger than this. I thought it was actually bigger than this, but it actually looks like it might be comfortable. Well, with the people that I have seen, um, they say that it is a comfortable shoe. So, not bad. I mean, it looks exactly like it is in picture. So, that is the sneaker right here. And 
I mean, if you if you know what I'm talking about, the Back to the Future, where they have we'll close this down here, where they have. I'm not sure how. Well, it's not on right now, so we're gonna have to figure that out in a little bit. But that's the shoe right here. And I know it comes with the, another, the packaging is just totally out of this world. All right, so you got the other the box inside, which comes with the, I believe this is the cables to the, uh, to the charging station. And you also get, put this out here. I'm not sure the, I don't know what they call this, but it also comes with the package. I know it has a name. I'll probably look it up and it's gonna be in the description. So in the little box inside, you also have, I'm talking about the packaging is just totally out of this world. And I don't wanna mess it up. I don't wanna open it all crazy because, you know, this shoe will probably be sold one of these one day. Or just to hold them. I don't want to mess it up. All right, there we go. So you have your cables in here. You have the, and the charger. So this is the little box with the charger. So you're probably wondering why shoes are coming with a charger. Um, these are actually self lacing shoelaces. So they can be controlled with an app on your phone. So when I want to, you know, tie my shoelaces, I can actually do it on my phone and I'm gonna try to put that in there. But if you don't have your phone around, you actually press a, these two buttons right here, which this will tighten the shoelaces and this will untie the shoelaces. So we'll get into that. I just wanted to show you the packaging for now. So we're gonna put this back. Um, if I can't put it in there. There we go. Put this to the side right here and inside you have another all right so this is the charging station so you connect it to the wires and this is the charging station looks like a little scale so you kind of put it down like so and then the shoes actually go over here and once they then this is how you actually charge the shoes so there you have it. This is what's in the box, which is a nice box and it's just packaged so well. So there it is. So now we'll go into the little details and see how we actually put them on the charger and try to do the app. And cause I know I have to download an app for them and we'll see how that goes. So I hope you like the packaging. I mean, the packaging is nicely done and yeah. I can see why I paid that much money because I'm actually paying for this box too and everything in it. So, but yep, there you have it. So we'll get into the little details on how we actually charge the shoes and see if we can turn them on. All right, so right now the shoes are actually charging. This is crazy. You never seen something like this before. So basically you just pick it up from there and it just kind of stops charging. You put it back on there, it starts charging. That's crazy. So we're gonna let them charge for a little bit, then we'll see how they fit. So, the shoe has been on the charger for the last 15 minutes and it's blinking green now. So I'm guessing that says it is fully charged. So I'm about to take them off. All right, guys, the, again, the box is amazing. So you take this right out in the middle and the charging pad is down there. So that goes down there and you just, this kind of separates the shoe. So once that's done, you just put the shoe in. 
and then the other shoes go on the other side and there they go it's a pretty nice setup i like it the box itself is just amazing you know every side is different side of it is different and it looks pretty cool so I'm gonna try the shoe on and see how they fit as a matter of fact before I actually try the shoe on I want you to see this real quick so you have the little positive negative sign right here so if you actually tie your shoelace you press it and it goes that's how you tie the shoes. And that is pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. So right now, I'm about to put it on. And once you stand, it should kind of lace it just by themselves, but we're just gonna try to do it on ourselves right now. So there you have it. Oh man, you could definitely feel it. It just went tight. I like it. They're so comfortable. And they're loose right now. That's awesome. Yeah, that's that's awesome. But anyways, this is my first review on this shoe and many to come so stay tuned again you know this is just for my you know uh youtube channel if you're not into shoes you don't have to it's just for the sneakerheads out there but there you have it the auto air max investing in the future that's what it is right here it's just the idea behind the shoe that's all it is so all right there you go guys all right, so one last thing, I have actually connected them to the to the app on the phone. So the right one, you just go like this, and that's how you release the lace. And the next one, if you want to tie it up, that's how you tie it up. That's pretty cool. And then if you want to have like a save mode, I think I'm 55 right here. I'm comfortable right here at 40 and then you save it so basically pretty much has your battery and you could change the color on the side right here so if I go green or yellow it goes yellow if I go blue blue like that's what the colors is right here if i go yellow right here if i go orange if i go red if i go purple orange whatever you want pretty cool with no lights there we go so that's that right there let's just move but overall, man, this is something totally different. So there you have it, guys. Cool. Fire. That's what it is. Investing in the future. That's exactly what this shoe is. Again, I'm just, you know, this is what I do. If I'm not in the truck, this is what I'm doing. I'm buying shoes. I'm doing something with the cars. I like cars. I like shoes. So stay tuned for more shoes. If you like it, just put it in the comment section and, it, you know, we keep it dropping. But... Again, this is this might not be for my box truck people, you know, but you know, this is for my sneakerheads out there. Um, we're gonna do some stuff to the car and you know, I don't know, you know, just try to just show you a little side of me that's not in the truck. And you know, once you understand the person you're dealing with, um, you know, it makes it a little better to understand what I do and why I do what I do, you know? Um, so yeah. That's that. But anyways, for my box truck people, it's Friday. We got a Friday to Friday load. Uh, we'll get into that and stay tuned for the next video. Thank you for watching and I hope you liked it. If you don't, hey man, it might not be for everybody, right? 
um again it's just a little segment that i'm doing it's going to be my friday night um sneaker review segment so you know if you're not into it then hey it's all good but um yeah so thank you for watching um i hope you like it subscribe um you know share comment and hit that notification button and i'll catch you next friday with the next um sneaker review stay tuned peace out